G'day, today we're doing a, a slight repair and a service on a VZ Commodore 2005 V6 It's got the 4L60E transmission in it Now I've tried to get a code out of it um, It's just got real sluggish shifts, I'd say it hasn't been serviced for a while But what I'm also going to do is I'm going to just remove this they call it a manifold switch plate um, it just has little pressure switches in it as well um, it's probably worth just taking it off and just flushing it out as well so this one's not throwing any codes so I don't believe uh, it's a real issue but it's a good idea to just uh, maintain these things keep them as clean as you can they'll last a lot longer you can see the uh the magnet there is covered and all the other fine metallic debris there. Okay I've got the switch plate out and you can see how much fine metal I'll just wait for the camera to focus if it will. You can see how much fine metal has accumulated on those little pressure switches there. Um, pressure actually is directed through here and that's um, I mean if you can see there are actually it shows which switches in what gear um, drive reverse etc but it's a good idea to give it a bit of a flush out um, it'll just stop pushing all that fine metal in under the switch I'll give it a bit of a flush and then you'll see um, how this one comes up I've got magnets under my little wash tray there you can see how much metal has come out of this already you can see the what the switches are supposed to look like you can see there's still a little bit of metal it's actually underneath that plate um, in the old days they didn't have this little plastic cover on it so you could actually pull these seals out replace them they've got a little bit smarter now so you can't flush it out um, in every instance but still worth doing um, you, you'll just extend the life of this component so I'll just give that a bit of a clean out and uh, give it a light blow out um, don't use full pressure there you can actually do a little bit of damage there if you blast it with 100 psi air pressure there we go I've cleaned it out you can see this one up here where my thumb is that's uh, D4 got low D3 D2 and reverse there's a little stamp there shows you which switch does what um, quite often people think that um, the solenoids giving a problem but it's actually this manifold switch plate so in a service if you really want to do a proper service it's a good idea to pop these off and just give it a flush um, if they're too bad um, you'll, you might even have to replace it but you can see I've just blown out um, through the little cracks in the side trying to get um, a lot of that fine metal out of the way uh, these are a non-magnetic component unlike a solenoid so um, if you do flush it out or wash it out it will actually stay out but you can see it's come up quite well you'll just get a lot more life and uh, out of the transmission and the transmission will run a lot better anyway I'll pop that back on uh, replace the filter clean the transmission pan magnet and the pan and uh, Bob's your uncle. Thank you for watching.